Welcome to day number nine in the prep for Strongman Champions League WRB, which I believe stands for World Record Breakers. Um, starting off this workout with some throws, some sack throws, but uh, since there aren't that many people in the gym right now, I don't tend to have anyone to throw the weight down for me, unless Kaori there would be willing to do it. Um, yeah, I think it's three sets of three reps. Last week I did it with a 19 kilogram bag. This week, no, last week I did it with an 18. Now I'm gonna be able to do it with a 19. And yeah, good times had by all. Then we're gonna do some deadlifts and leg press, and hamstring curls and, and frame. First time training frame in at least two years, maybe three years even. I know, I think it's two years, two and a half. Oh, all right, let's get down to business. Heldur var til að gera fyrir mig huge greiða. Kasta pokanum niður. Þrjú reps. Takk maður. Byrja bara. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Two more. Kind of, tiny bit uncomfortable for the shoulder. Good shit. Yo, Takella. So yeah, this is just preparation. And last week I saw the following sets after the first one got a lot more explosive and better. So this is the first set. You're seeing the worst of me. And I hope you're goddamn impressed. No, I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the deadlift. <coughs> All right, guys, just warming up for a little truck pull. So if I'm supposed to give a little bit of a um, sorry about what happened yesterday. During the throwing, I think the second or the third set, I felt a little tiny bit of something in my lower back on the left side. Um, and, uh, but then I started warming up for deadlifts, didn't think too much of it. And then I went up to 170, it's just something didn't feel right. It just felt like I was having trouble walking out, like there was a lot of inflammation in my lower back. And just, you know, so I did 170, then 170 again, and then 170 again, and I decided to do 170 for a double, and I could just tell, like, not, something's not correct, but I tried loading it up to 195 kilograms, like, on the plan, for three sets of three, and as I was loading it, I could just tell, like, something's not right here. I said, hold up, wait a minute, something ain't right. Something's not right. And I had a bit of a think, and I uh, decided to uh, stop the workout. It's not worth risking. And I had a bit of a panic actually because I was getting worse and worse, more and more inflammation in, uh, in my lower back. And I was just like getting very worried, a bit depressed, a bit panic. Um, talked to my coach, went to the pool. And then in the evening, I actually didn't feel that bad. I felt pretty good. And today, you know, I feel a tiny bit of something, but like no nerve pain, nothing like that at all. I just feel a tiny bit on the left side of my lower back. Um, it's nothing crazy. It's just a little bit, but a truck pull. Uh, but well, to say one thing first, me and my coach decided I'm just going to take a little bit of a deal of the week. Um, and then now, but now, you know, we have this opportunity to train truck pull and, you know, truck pull is not back heavy it's a lot more you know uh, glutes calves hamstrings quads and lats it's not a lot of your lower back so you know I'm gonna see how it feels I'm gonna try it but we're gonna train this trouble these guys are all preparing for strongest man in Iceland I'm not but we never know if there's gonna be truck pull in 
you know, competitions in uh, this summer. So why not get it in? I thought my cardio was great. Until it did truck. It's okay. There was a thought that Chris down cut it off. Jesus. Yeah. I thought my cardio was better than that. Wow. That pushed me. Oh. Flott form, halda þessu, halda bara áfram. Fast. Sonic the Hedgehog fast. <sighs> Come on. Oh, jeez, Louise, what a day! That was nice. Two 
um, truck pull attempt um, attempt goes um, practice runs <sighs> yeah now I feel drained and uh, yeah a little bit of joke about my cardio like I thought it was better um, you know what it has it is actually pretty good and you know uh, at least a couple of the guys said that you know my goals were the fastest of the guys so I guess that's something but we didn't um, time it or anything but they said my mo mine moves very quick so that's good and you know so yeah I have these temptations now that I'm thinking about it of competing in strongest man on Iceland but you know I would uh, it's just something funny to think about because I'm training forward hold and you know a lot of things would be good events for me and but we'll see I don't know I would probably you know as my coach said he would like he wouldn't hold it against me if like all of a sudden I woke up on Wednesday and I just thought hey I want to do it but I'm not just deciding anything right now I'm gonna give myself more time to think about it and see how my body feels my back feels good feels great um, better than before so you know movement is key to getting better with these sorts of things and you know it's it's, it's nothing serious um, yeah oh but now I'm gonna go home meal prep and then I'm gonna go to a pool for a swim really like swimming also been doing some rotator cuff work in the pool just with you know water resistance and I feel like that's almost been like helping me a bit which is great but yeah truffle haven't trained truffle since 2022 it's been a while oh but I think I'm gonna let that be it for today um yeah, like, I, like I've been saying, I want to document the process and I want to be honest and I want to have it be like perfectly clear with everything, not to try to fake, fake it when I'm feeling, you know, too good or, or, but just, you know, be clear and tell you guys when I'm feeling bad. If something's not, you know, because I've been told and read in multiple places by multiple people um, that, you know, the progress with a herniated disc the rehab, it isn't linear. It isn't just a clear cut line straight upwards. You're gonna have bad days, then you're gonna have great days, and then you're again gonna have bad days. And but but like if I just compare from now, from two, three weeks ago, I'm just I feel massive difference. So yeah, it's just <sighs> happy with things. Yeah. All right, guys. Hope you guys are having a great day. Hope you guys are getting closer to your goals. I'm going to go ahead and eat. And yeah, have a nice day. All right. Hope you're having a good one. Goodbye.